Welcome everybody to Minutes of Motivation. This is Dr. Ron Kelly, and I have the honor of being here with the Admiral, David Robinson. Now, a lot of athletes are known for what they do on the field or on the court, but David is known for what he did on the court and also in the classroom and overall just how he carries himself. So we're going to interview the Admiral real quick and get some insight on education and motivation. Let's talk about it. How you doing today, Mr. Robinson? Great. How you doing? All right. I, I told you when I first uh, started talking with you how you were an inspiration to me and in school your your father was there to present a scholarship to me and things like that so right away my image of you was associated with education you being an Annapolis graduate a lot of people don't realize that's one of the most selective universities in the world absolutely so overall what is it for for all the kids out there a lot of kids watch my show you know me being a former principal so they watch and want to know some tips and things like that yeah. what is it that made you choose the path of you know not having the same image you're not on TV with your pants sagging yeah. and things like that you have a professional image how did you choose that route and how did it work for you well I, I, it starts with your parents I mean that's you, you have to have good parenting somebody to, to talk to you or some some parental father influence or something to say look my dad used to make me sit down and read the dictionary as a child and I thought what are you doing dad why would I have to read the dictionary this is crazy but he wanted me to understand the importance of education. And, and no matter, people can take my money away from me, but tomorrow I can go right back out and go make it again. Because, you know, I have the wherewithal to do it. And, and so that's the thing I try to encourage kids. I say, the, the best opportunity you have to be successful is get in that classroom and do your work. There are schools out there, they come to me all the time, the Harvards and the Yales, they come to me and they say, hey, where are the kids? And you know, we're out there looking for them. We'll give them scholarships, we'll fly them back and forth four times a year. Um, we just we want kids who can do the work and so you know that's been one of my jobs to get out to these schools and to talk to these kids and start them off young and say man the opportunities are out there they're they're out there looking to, to give you these opportunities so so you know all it takes from you is some effort Good. And your investment was a school. You know, a lot of athletes choose to purchase a nightclub or a restaurant. And, <laughs> yeah. and right away, early in your career, you invested in the Carver Academy and, yeah. you know, put your, your backing and your name behind it. Why that option? While everyone else was starting a record label and yeah. doing all those yeah. things like that, why education? Why? Because there's a big problem. Uh, you know, when we look around and what's happening to African-Americans around this country, um, we are we're going at an unsustainable pace. We cannot keep doing what we're doing. We cannot keep sending our young people to jail. We cannot keep dropping out of school. We cannot keep the lifestyles up that we're, we're, we're we have going on in in so many environments. We're killing each other. There's it, it's it's just not possible. I don't know where we're going to be two or three generations from now. But if we keep this pace up, we may not be here two or three generations from now. And it's that serious of a problem. So to me, education is the way out of that. Um, George Washington Carver said, education is the, the key that unlocks the, the golden door to freedom. And, and, and I believe that. I believe that once we start to create a generation of leaders, then we'll have examples for our young men to follow and, and, and we'll begin to see a change in, in our culture. Good. Well, thank you for your time. Thanks for being on Minutes of Motivation. My pleasure. I'm Dr. Ron Kelly. That's David Robinson. And that was Minutes of Motivation. Thank you.